shed a tear Dance through the night and kiss by the fire Share some old stories who smile at your side And these were the times before San Francisco Days before Basil and Monaco Times before France and Japan Before you met that young girl who met both by West Beer and today we were singer-songwriter Zoe Bastille. Hello! Hi! How are you doing today? I'm good actually, how are you? Yeah, I'm right. good, fine. <laughs> so how are you enjoying the sun? Uh, it's nice. It's unusual for Scotland but I think Very. it's quite lovely. I'm enjoying it, it's nice. Yeah. Wasn't a good day to wear a big... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. A bit too hot. Yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> yeah. So we interviewed you last time at Wickerman. Yes, yeah. So are you excited for the French? How does it do you think it compares to a festival? Um I think I think at the moment, as you can probably tell, there's a lot more people at a festival. Yeah. <laughs> um and I think I think the atmosphere is quite interesting. This is a lot more like busking, but I think that's fun. I think that's a different thing that I enjoy doing. So I'm yeah. looking forward to this. It's looking fantastic though. I'm loving all the outside cafe bits. They look yeah, really, really nice. You can smell all the food. It's quite hungry. <laughs> Get something after the show. Yeah, yeah. So, what would you scri describe your music style as? Uh, probably kind of new folk, kind of uh, modern folk pop, really. Uh, singing songwriter kind of genre. Yeah. yeah. So, how long have you been singing for? Um, I've been singing, well, apparently I've been singing before I could speak. But wow. um, <laughs> the way I like this, I've been doing it for almost three years now. Oh, yeah. So, who are your musical influences? Oh, gosh. Um, see, I was asked this and I've forgotten what I said, but a lot of singer songwriters. I think, especially, I really enjoyed watching Amy McDonald and Katie Tunstall at Wicker Man. They're oh, probably amazing influences being singer songwriters themselves. Mm -hmm. I really, it was nice to kind of go, right, I could do that one day. Maybe they let me. <laughs> Really cool. Yeah. So what are your future plans after this? Future plans? Well, I've got a few more gigs that you can find on my website, zoebestel.co.uk, but um, there's also got an album in the studio in the next couple of weeks. Ooh, so looking excited. forward to that. It's going to be cool. Yeah. So you're only 16? Yeah, I've only just turned 16. My birthday was a couple of days ago, actually. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm still eating cake. You, you can extend your breath. Yeah, exactly. Really. That's all right. <laughs> so 
Where do you see yourself in 10 years? 10 years, yeah. wow. Uh, I don't know, hopefully I want to still be a musician. I think so I you. think doing well Hi. in music land, I think. I think yeah. Yeah. With a few more, maybe, a few more people yeah. liking yeah. my stuff, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, One last question for you. Yeah. Out of all the songs that you've written yourself, what yeah. means most to you? What means most to you? Wait, what was your favourite song? My favourite song? Oh gosh. Um, wow. I'm singing quite a few new ones today, I think. Um, so I'm looking, I think always my new one is always my favourite because I'm, I'm always proud of it. I'm going, yeah, I like doing this. this is good. Thank you so much oh, for thank talking you for your to us today. Thank you. This has been Lauren Ritchie from Waffle TV, sponsored by Westbeer.